Hey, it's Kiana Thompson of Holistic Harmony, Mind, Body, and Soul, a solution-focused therapy agency with 100% satisfaction in building quality, passionate relationships. And this is your bonus video, Aries. Yay! I'm excited. I feel like we're just going to dive deep into these cards and just see what they say for you. I'm not in my usual space, but I got my cards, boo. I got my cards. I'll take them everywhere I go. Um, thank you guys for being the number one video watchers um for the month before last i think <laughs> but i think scorpio beat you out last time so they get a bonus video too but you guys did like whoa okay you guys was like we want all the information and i'm here for it so thank you guys so much so this is your bonus read um I'm gonna use a lot of that because we're gonna get into. I'm just gonna be nosy and see what that's see what the universe got to say for y'all. Commitment. Okay. Some of y'all getting real clear on some commitment choices, whether in love or money, but definitely could be relationship. Um you've had to do some forgiveness work. It's time for you to let some stuff go. Aries, it's your season as I'm making this video. Okay, happy birthday, Aries. Um, y'all got to do some forgiveness. I know y'all rule about Mars, you know, the god of war <laughs> and love. But, um, y'all got to forget some people, especially y'all selves, okay? Get some closure. Get your own damn closure. Be your own closure. It's time for y'all to move on. It's time for y'all to heal. Okay, I see. Listen, look what popped all the way out. Blessings. It's time for y'all to get it. It's time for y'all to get it. Go ahead and do the work so y'all can get everything that's coming to y'all, okay? Just be inside of your truth, you know? Let's speak the truth. Live the truth. Be the truth. Um, home is very important. You could be selling your home, leaving to like spruce it up, or you could be buying a home, moving. Animals are very important to you. You could have animals. You could work with animals. You could be dreaming about animals because Pisces is in Mercury right now as we're making it, as I'm making this video. So you could be dreaming about animals. Pay attention. Reconciliation. It's time for you to forgive. It's time to forgive some people. You could be being reunited with old friends, uh, past lovers, Aries. I heard y'all got it going on. I ain't never been with Aries, but I do love me some Aries. And I heard y'all got it going on. Okay, okay. Stay protected. Keep protecting yourself. Know that you are divinely protected. You're going to get all the answers you need to get. Fertility. What y'all giving birth to? Okay, y'all giving birth to something. Could be babies. Could be businesses. You know, could be good health. That's all. You're just fertile. You're just fertile. It's your birthday. It's your, your, your new year. You know what I'm saying? It's your birthday. You feeling good. You feeling fertile. You feeling protected. And look at that. Blessings again. Come on here. Come on here and get all the birthday blessings. I'm here for it. Yeah. More blessings. Come on. Y'all not fucking around, Aries. That's why I think I really like doing y'all reading because... <laughs> Y'all energy be lit lit. It be lit lit. So you could be, you know, coming into some coinages. Somebody uh, either hiring you, bonusing you, want to invest in your business. You're being very stable um, and secure. You, you're feeling very secure and stable in your life. Confident. Um, you may need to get some rest, Aries, because I do know... You guys are high energy, right? So you might need to be getting some rest and making sure that you are. You got a lot of chakras um, showing up. So make sure you're taking the time to take care of your chakras um, and get in alignment. Do some chakra work. Maybe some chakra healing. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Throat chakra just came up. So I can see four of them now. Oh. Okay. Universe really wants you to know you're coming into some money. Someone really is going to offer you a coin. Wants to invest in you. Um... A feminine energy wants to invest in you or you could be the feminine energy with all the money but there is a storm coming so be patient with that could be a little chaotic a little drama you probably like a good storm Aries, because you're very strategic with the war oh god you're like oh we in a storm let me be real strategic <laughs> Uh, be patient though because after the storm all your uh wish will be fulfilled blessings upon blessings you know are just coming it's gonna be harvest time you're gonna be healed you're gonna be happy you're gonna walk right on through the door and there's no reason to be feeling you know all tied up about anything 
because you're healing you are definitely in the healing space you could uh, you could be physically healing from something especially with all those chakras needing to be aligned because on the spiritual side you know it's the chakras but they also represent um different you know energy points in our body but also different physical points in our body as well too so you could be doing some healing you could be with um a king of cups or a water sign could be coming your way or you could be with somebody that's scorpio cancer pisces they love you um you could just have a lot going on in your head you need to take some time out to get you to collect your thoughts but you can stop worrying you could be having trouble sleeping starting some new stuff you could be traveling you definitely being called to higher levels higher elevation so that could be spiritually and physically like i see a lot of travel um a lot of doors opening and closing king of swords um you could be doing some you could be uh, you know having that energy coming towards you um Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, but I also feel like you could be having a type of court case or something or something to deal with, some type of authority with that judgment in the King of Swords. They have a soulmate energy, also Gemini, Two of Cups, whoa, Aries, I told y'all, I heard y'all the bomb, okay, I heard y'all the bomb, Aries, y'all got cups and lovers and all type of stuff, yeah, you could be you know you could be fighting just to have makeup sex areas like somebody could be picking a fight your person could be trying to like poke at you a little bit so that you would get fired up Ew, okay okay um but yeah definitely some old ways closing some new ways um beginning let's get you some cards for this bonus read so you're moving fast. Um, you could be getting a new car, fast forward movement. But I feel like you're moving fast, Aries. Like it's your season, it's your time. And you're just ready to take charge. You know where you're going. You know what you want. And you're here for it. You're ready. You're ready to move forward. Yeah, you're working hard. You're investing in yourself. You're working on your craft. You're doing it the 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 things that make you happy. You're doing the self work, Aries, and it's paying off. It's paying off. I just um yesterday was really rough. I saw a few people post a Virgo and a uh, Aries. They both posted about yesterday being rough, and I had literally made a video on my TikTok about yesterday being rough, and saying like honestly, um that's where the breakthrough happens when things are, are, are going rough, right? You, you've taken control of your life. You're doing the things that you want to do. You're doing the things that you're supposed to do. You're investing in yourself. You're self-loving. And then, bam, it's hard. <laughs> hard as hell. You're exhausted. You're tired. You're like, oh, my God. I just I quit. I don't want this. And then your higher self say, but no, we're not done. You got to get up. You got to move. You got to do this. Let's go do the work. And I feel like that's where you are, Aries. I feel like you're moving forward. You're doing the self-work. You're doing the self-love. Look at this. Woo! Listen, universe is talking to you, okay? 
Everything is divine timing. Everything is happening just as it should. Just as it should. And because you're putting in the work, you're going to be blessed. The will of fortune is in your favor. It's, you know, it's it's coming. And you're going to have reason to celebrate. You're going to have reason to celebrate. I feel like you might need to go out and have some fun. Call up. So funny. Knight of Swords popped out, flipped back in. Knight of Pentacles came out. Um, you got a steady, solid offer coming towards you. Nine of Swords. The Empress at the bottom of the deck with the moon. Six of Pentacles. I like it. I like it a lot. So listen, check it. You... You're moving fast. You're moving forward. You're moving positively in a positive swing, a positive direction. You could have just decided like, hey, I want to take control of my life. I want to take control of my health. I want to take control of my romance. I want to take control of my business. And then you start doing the fucking work, Aries. Because that's what the Aries does. Aries is direct. They know what they want. When they Once they figure it out, they make the plan. They move forward. Period. Also, um, this is cancer energy. But you moving forward, you're doing the work, you're doing what makes you happy. You're working on yourself, you're working on your business, you're working on your relationships, and the tides are turning. Things are turning in your favor because you are doing the work and you know what you want. You're moving forward, the universe is blessing you because it's like, hey, you know what you want, you know what you're doing, and you're going to have time to socialize and have a good time. Celebrating your wins. Look at this. <laughs> what did I tell you? Some of you are moving forward with your money. Okay? Some of you are moving forward with money, honey. I feel like someone wants to invest in you and they're going to move fast. Somebody could be gifting you a car. Somebody could be um, offering you a job. And it's and it could be somewhere else. They could be asking you to, to relocate or something like that. Moving fast. But they know they want you. They want what you got. And they're coming. They're they're they want to give you money. Attachment come out. Huh, daughter romance on the bottom of the deck. <laughs> Listen, I like it because I'm, I'm laughing because I'm like, what are you attached to with this working car? Are you attached to work? Are you do you even have look at this under the door to romance? door to value come on here aries get everything do everything but what are you attached to something's holding you back you attach to the pain you attach to you know the shit that wasn't working and that's okay i get it it's like look at that you attach to work for sure eight of pentacles again You working hard, you workaholic, you being a workaholic. Two of cups. Yep, that's what I said. You attached to the pain. And so what you're doing is working really hard, um, which is cool because you're making the money, right? But you blocking out the real abundance, which is love and romance because, um, and, and the door to value, um, more money. So keep doing the work, right? But don't be a don't be attached so attached to work that you miss the opportunities to meet your soulmate and go out on dates and make even more money. Cause see, I remember in one of your reads, I can't remember if it was your twenty twenty one read or your January, oh you mean February, I can't remember. But I do know in one of your reads um, you are making a lot of money in 2021, lots and lots of money in 2021. And so you can't be so focused on the work that you miss the value of your work. Okay. So make sure you're not being attached to old ways of thinking, old ways of being, old ways of working, 
right it might you might have to start implementing some new um automation some new procedures some new operations some new things um that that frees you up so that you can go out on these dates and frees you up to make the big money okay 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 sometimes we gotta do the work behind the scenes so that we can enjoy um in front of the scenes enjoy the romance and the and the and the door to value because you got soulmate energy and you got and it's not just about you know a relationship it's about both romance and money somehow it's tied together because they, they both the doors are right here together so it tied together so you're working hard you're working on yourself it's beautiful don't be attached to any one thing person place or any one outcome don't be attached to the outcome like you're thinking you're working hard on your business in one way right and your business blow up in another way right that happens you know and, and businesses evolve relationships evolve things like that so if you are already coupled um you know don't be um closed off to the idea of romance if you're already coupled right your relationship needs to evolve as well you could be going on more dates and um you know what i'm saying like just be reviving and, and and recommitting to your person so whether you're single or 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 um you know couple it doesn't matter it's soulmate energy and so you could be with your soulmate or you could be meeting your soulmate but you being uh, uh too attached i think to stinking thinking and even too much could be possibly too attached to work doing the work right so you need to be making sure you do the self work the self love uh, and let go of the things that's not serving you let go of the toxicity let go this is like the devil card capricorn energy um let go of the um self-sabotage you could be self-sabotaging your work your love your health all that so no that's just a no okay yes okay i love a good read aries and y'all giving it to me cornucopia wish fulfillment when i tell you it's your time it's your time b like harvest what is it that you want get your basket go out there and get it you already grew it it's it's now it's time you did it that's what i'm saying you've already been working you've been working 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 and now it's time for you to be blessed it's time for all of the the harvest that you want it's time for all your wish fulfillment so you don't have to be attached to lack um old stinking thinking old relationships old people old jobs old way of relating you're 5d and it's time you've been strong you've been hanging in there and look what's look what's under there okay could be a leo okay with the strip card the man holding the heart um your mate could be you know have some leo placements or it just could feel like the man holding the heart feels like a best friend feels romantic feels loving feels you know what i'm saying like he's vulnerable he's telling you he loves you right like oh i love you like it ain't nothing like you the bomb but all your wishes are being fulfilled because you've been putting in the work it wants to come out so three of cups and the broken heart i'm sorry door to value <laughs> this is the three of cups listen you're gonna be celebrating all this money <laughs> aries 2021 where my airy friends at y'all we can take me on a trip or something because i listen these predictions are bomb I and mean, y'all got the money let's go i'm ready to celebrate you okay take me on a trip aries but you're gonna be celebrating with your friends um and i feel like you're gonna this heartbreak to me actually feels very healed it doesn't feel it doesn't feel broken it feels very very healed and so it could be some little residue left you know what i'm saying but it's more of a heart expansion it's more of a heart opener i feel like you're going to just be bursting with just goodness that is going to feel foreign to you aries it's going to feel like i don't have to go to war with nobody <laughs> i don't gotta be nobody's ass <laughs> No, Aries, you ain't got to fight today. All you got to do is collect your money and have fun with your friends. Take your girl on the trip, okay? 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 Like, yeah. I like it. 
let's see. Let's get into this heart. Let me see what this heart is about. Broken heart. I feel like y'all just made, y'all may do with a lot of things that hurt you and you made it work. You put, you put yourself in work. Yeah. You had some arguing and fighting. Some little stuff was going on. You had some challenges that, you know, could have took you out. But it didn't. It brought you more value. It made you more understanding. Whoa. I'm not going to even look this way too much. It's like 10 cards. That's the reason to celebrate. You found what? You found value in yourself. Look at this. Yes! That's all I need to see. Nine of cups. 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 Ay, 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 ay. That's just wish fulfillment. Everything that you want, everything that tried to break you, it did not break you. Okay? Everything that tried, it did not. Every person who tried did not. People who you thought were your friends, people who you thought was, you know, going to be the love of your life forever. Whatever the case may be, child did not work. It did not happen. Um, you know, family, friends, whoever, it did not happen. And you fought through those challenges, baby. You fought through them and you let your heart expand. And now you're celebrating. You're going to be celebrating soon if you're not already. Like, plan a party. Plan a trip. Plan whatever. Have some fun. And you know, you might be in the cups a little bit. You might be in your cups, you know, you know. You might just drink some green juice in your cup, though, okay? You ain't got to have alcohol. You can have some green juice. I have green juice all the time. Listen, you're going to be celebrating all your wins, all your money. It's going to be, like, everything that you value. And then you're going to be celebrating with good people. So the people who was out to hurt you or, you know, they were, they were lessons, right? And you went through those challenges. You went through those lessons. And now you're going to be celebrating with people who you love and who love you and who honor and cherish you and vice versa and you're gonna have all the money and all your wishes are gonna be fulfilled you're gonna be like almost like you're gonna just be uh, it's like unbelievable patience i want to know what this night is about oh <laughs> baby okay they coming for you. They coming for you. And look, what I tell you, soulmate energy. You in your bag, he in his bag, or he in his bag, she in her bag, y'all in y'all bag. Okay? Okay? Y'all in y'all bag. And not only are y'all in y'all bag, but y'all ready to invest into each other. You just got to be patient. It's coming. Like, the love is coming. It's just slow. But this is a good thing about it. The slowness of it um, is that it's... Slow and steady wins the race. You know, taking your time to get to know this person. I know Aries, because Aries is fast moving. You guys are starters. You're cardinal. you all um, about starting stuff, right? But this star is slow and steady. It's, it's solid. It's getting to know. It's a stable foundation. You're standing up for what you believe in. Oh my God. And you you okay with being single? You're successful. You're single. You're ready to mingle. And then here comes an offer coming in that's stable and secure. And you know, slow. And they want to get to know you. And they see you as fine and sexy and with all your money. And they got their own bag. Child. It's just not time. To move fast. They gonna make you an offer though. They definitely make it. And you gotta just take your time. I feel like you might not even. Uh, accept it right away. This could be somebody. Who. you They've already offered and you said no. And not a past lover. This doesn't feel like a past lover. This doesn't feel like a reconciliation. But it does feel like it's somebody that you know. Maybe the offers to go out on a date. And you was like, eh, no, I'm not interested. You was guarded. You was like, no, I don't want to do that. I'm working. I'm working on myself. I'm working on my business. I don't have time to date. And I feel like they're going to come back around and offer you again. They're going to say, hey, let's go out. And maybe this time you don't be so guarded. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got this. You got three of swords again. It's like you are like my heart has been broke. I have healed it and I don't have I'm not going through none of that no more. I'm not I'm not up for the challenge, but you are Aries. Yeah, you've done the work. You've done the self-work. And I feel like this per Yes, Ten of Pentacles. Oh. You have done the work. You stood up for yourself. You you know, you you've been you're being patient. You're not rushing in. And this person doesn't want to rush in either. They've been watching you. They 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 know they know you some. You guys know each other already. They've already and they think you're beautiful and they want to be with you. And they're like, hey, let's go out. You're like, no leave me alone um i feel like they're gonna offer again and i feel like they they are stable they want to marry you i feel like they want to be in a long-term relationship with you aries they want to do the whole king caboodle kids and house and money build money together like i said soulmate energy they got a bag you got a bag let's build together what let's build an empire let's you know take care of our family let's break generational curses together let's build generational wealth like they want to do all of that but you and I feel like they're going to be patient with you because you're like guarded and heartbroke. Oh, Aries. It ain't nothing like breaking no uh, Aries heart, okay? Because they don't even, they, they want to be, they ain't got one. <laughs> Sorry, Aries. Like, we don't got no feelings. Oh, okay. You fire, your passion. Of course you got feelings. You're real bad Mars. Mars have to have drive and passion to be able to strategically win the wars. That's all about passion. It is and all about sex. It so yeah, you heart broke. You had some challenges and some fights before that got you guarded and like walls up. I'm not letting it in. But this person is offering you something. Take a look at it again. They probably already asked you out before and you said no. Take a look again. And it's not reconciliation. It's this person. You, you, you know them, but you have not been out with them. Okay? And it could be a, um earth sign. Um, What's the earth sign, y'all? Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo. Could be an earth sign. You do have cancer here. Capricorn. So, you know what I'm saying? But this person does want long-term stability with you. And they, they want to create something beautiful. So, it's up to you. But you do got something good coming. And if you are already coupled, this is still you being patient with your person and building something. They, you know, they want to be, they want to be married. They want to be in a, a family situation. If you're already in that situation, there's, they just be patient with creating it and building it how you guys want it to be built. Door to spirit. Yeah. So you could be definitely not sleeping. Um, but I feel like you're not sleeping is a little, is because door to spirit is open. You might be having a lot of dreams, downloads. You could be waking up at the, you know, what they call the witching hour between 3 and 4 a.m. Um, like, why am I woke right now? Look at your clock, see what time it is, write it down, look it up, um, numerology, angel numbers. Um, if you had dreams, write them down. Like I said, we're in Pisces season right now. I mean... We're in your season, but Pisces is in Mercury doing wrecking havoc on our dreams, but bringing us lots of information. Remember, Mercury is about information and, and, and tech. Um, and so Pisces is over there. So we're getting a lot of information in our dreams right now. So you could be not sleeping, having lots of dreams, door to spirits open. People could be visiting you as well. If you have that um that type of you know ability you could be getting dreams uh you know uh, not dreams but pe literal um ancestors could be coming to see you people that have passed over who have messages for you could be coming to talk to you at night so you may be not sleeping let's get some cards some more let's get some more information what else do you want um aries to know in their bonus read I feel like you're going to have some haters, too. Whoa. So watch out for that. Clarity. Yeah. You're getting closure at the bottom. What I tell you? 
some you are getting closure you're giving yourself closure about some things you're getting real clear um about what you need to let go of and how to move forward in your life and haters gonna hate look what's up under the hater your soulmate yeah get out your own way stop focusing on people that's envious of you stop being envious of other people get, move this get rid of this energy okay get rid of this energy What else do you want uh, Aries to know in their bonus read? <laughs> Prosperity lies ahead. Yes. Now you got some Taurus energy. You got a lot of earth energy. Listen. Prosperity lies ahead. Let's just go and ask a question then. When is this prosperity happening? Because y'all got all y'all reads is money, Aries. All the ones that I've been doing this year. When is when is Aries getting his money? Prosperity. When is Aries getting his money? Remain positive. One more. Take action. <laughs> okay, one more. One more. This situation will improve. <laughs> I'm trying to be nosy. And it's like, no. Okay. So you got remain positive, take action, and the situation will improve. I do feel like though with that, with, with that being said, prosperity lies ahead. Um soon. As you move, right? As soon as you do the as soon as you get out your own way. So you're doing the work, keep doing the work. You probably already see the money coming in. Just keep your vibe high. Move forward again. This take charge, take action. Look just like the chariot, moving forward fast and furious, doing the things you need to do. And if anything is not the way you want it, remain positive and take action. And you're getting a lot of clarity too. You got the clarity card. Some of you may need a personal reading. The clarity looks like a crystal ball to me. If you need a personal read, you want it from me, then reach out. There's lots of readers all over YouTube, all over wherever. Um, but, you know, I got to plug myself too. <laughs> if you want a private read, everything you need will be in the description box. But, yeah, you just got to be clear. You're going to get clear on some things. Remain positive. Make it clear on some situations. So, the first card is, when you improve self, the world improves because of it. That's what I'm telling you. You're doing a lot of self-healing, self-work, work on your business, work on your health. And as you continue to improve yourself, you improve the world. And then you got, my purpose is to lead by example. And it's like the video that I said I made on TikTok. It's all about, you know doing it even when you're tired like i said you putting in work doing stuff even when you're tired doing it even when you just want to give up or whatever right and you not you keep going you keep doing it aries and you show us you lead by example that's your life purpose because when you improve yourself you improve the world thank you guys so much if you want to support the channel all of the information is inside of the description box how to get in contact with me how to set up a personal read how to um, get a Kiana said deck a divine love kit whatever it is that you um would like to do okay thank you guys so much i appreciate you and i love y'all so life peace out